When Joan Fontaine played Rowena in this movie, she was nearing the end of her active days in Hollywood, would soon begin working all over the globe and also appearing quite often on television, including a run on a 1980s TV series, Ryan's Hope. Now, she'd made her film debut in 1935 in a film starring Joan Crawford and Robert Montgomery called No More Ladies. Built in that movie is Joan Burfield. 1935 was the same year that her sister Olivia de Havilland made her film debut. Well, Olivia's career immediately took off while Joan kept being cast in supporting parts, eventually changing her name to Joan Fontaine, and often oddly cast as she was in the 1937 musical A Damsel in Distress, in which she was Fred Astaire's leading lady and dance partner, which was an awkward booking since Joan wasn't a dancer, but was required to do a couple of numbers with The Great Astaire. Well, she did her best, but immediately was tagged Fred's worst partner. But all that was quickly forgotten when, over such actresses as Vivian Lee, Margaret Sullivan, and Loretta Young, Joan won the lead in Alfred Hitchcock's Rebecca, and then starred in Hitchcock's Suspicion, winning the Academy Award for the latter. She also became, at age 24, the youngest actress to win an Academy Award. For several years after that, she was probably the most sought-after actress in Hollywood when anyone was looking for a very delicate, beautiful leading lady in a film. Joan's final appearance in a feature film was in the 1966 Hammer Tale of Terror called The Witches, which was titled The Devil's Own in this country. That was her last theatrical film, although she kept doing TV movies and making appearances on various TV series for the next 28 years. Up next, we go back a decade from Ivanhoe and the career of Joan Fontaine for a movie from 1943, which brought her an Academy Award nomination number three. Today on Turner Classic Movies, we remember the captivating charm of Joan Fontaine, next as The Constant Nymph. Then newlywed Joan is a victim before the fact in Alfred Hitchcock's suspicion, and Fontaine has trouble fitting in because of Rebecca.